Hey guys, my name is George and this is SAS Master. Today we're going to check out Shape.so. Now I think it's pretty cool, fun, and easy to use. Now if you guys are interested in grabbing the deal, the link will be in the description. It's not an affiliate link, it'll just go straight to the purchase. Now if you guys find this video interesting, please like, comment, and subscribe. Now what is Shape about? Well, Shape is kind of, obviously you get icons, you get images, and you get some also other type of templates. Now, like I said, it's pretty cool. And right now it's at a, it's 50 bucks and you have it for a lifetime. And what it does, it's like a simple editor to grab the icons that you need and change the colors also inside of this SAS. Now, before we jump into the actual dashboard, I just wanna show you, okay, you got the UI templates and this pricing. So right now it's 50 bucks and you get 2000 plus icons. You get formats like SVG, JSON, and code, unlimited downloads, commercial use allowed, because I know this is really important for some of the people here that are fans, that you gotta use this for commercial. So it's possible. And they didn't put PNG, but you can also download PNG. So let's head on over to the dashboard. All right, let's go to the app. Now what I found cool about this is that you can change colors right from here. Now, I've used other services like Envato where I have to download a whole bunch of icons that I don't need because I just need one or two. And then I had to edit them in a different SaaS like software. In this case, I can edit it right inside of here. So, for example, if I like these type of uh, icons, I can select these pre-made presets. You can see this right here. Just click on it and it'll change it. Now, maybe you're saying, hey, you know what? The branding on my side is white and blue, all right? So let's just say primary color is gonna be white and secondary color will be red, all right? So just see how easy that was to change. Now, maybe you're saying, hey, you know what? Um, it's in dark mode. My site is not actually black, so I don't know how it's going to look. So I can click on this color, which is a background. And right now, example, it's blue. But let's just say, hey, you know what? My site is white. So now if I click white, I am able to actually see how the icon would preview on white. So you can see right there, I selected primary color white, so it's not gonna work for me. So let's just change it to black, right? So now we see red and black, and now it works. Or I could just remove the background color and we can see it as it would. Now for this purpose, I'll just select that. Now there's a whole bunch of icons that you can select right here and they're all customizable in that sense of colors that you can switch one with the other like primary and second. In this type of icons, it's only one color so it's gonna select the styling color from the primary color. I mean, but there's a whole bunch of them and you can search for example, lock, right? And you get anything that's related to lock and you can see all these options right here. Now. If you like what you are seeing, you can select it and you can say, you know what? I'll use code if you wanna use coding. I'll use um, SVG, do I wanna select times one, times two, times three, that's being sizing. And if I select here, I got PNG also as an option. You can download it and use it over there. Other cool and interesting things is that we can find over here are animated icons. So in animated icons, there's not a lot of them right now, but it's pretty cool that we have the option. You can see the icon moving on the bottom right. If I click on this little Wi-Fi signal, it moves over here. You can see the bell moving. Now icons are based on JSON, so be aware of that if you're gonna use these icons. Now I'm pretty sure they will be adding more, but let's hope they do. Also, we got illustrations. Illustrations, I've seen a whole bunch of sasses right now using these types of illustrations. They're becoming super, super popular. And it's pretty cool that we got this option right here. And let me switch the colors a bit. All right. See, it's just going to depend on the branding that you have that the, you're going to select the colors. That's not really nice. Okay, let's just use that for now. So you can see there's a whole bunch of these and they're all customized to the colors that we selected. I mean, I'm pretty sure that you've seen a lot of these icons. Check this out. If I select it, I can view it bigger. I can grab the code and I can also download it. But I am just scroll down like this because I want to show you really quick that there's a lot of them. There you go. You got all these and I'll go a little bit faster. There's a lot of options right here. And like I said, they're becoming really popular to use these because they're fun. They're animated. And this is actually what's man. I can't. OK, there we go. Finally. All right. This is the end of all the icons. So there's a whole bunch of them. And I really like that you can change the colors. Also, there's animated illustrations. So not a lot of them yet, 
Oh wait, sorry, no, there are a lot of these. So if I click on this guy, the skateboard guy, you can see on the bottom right that he's actually moving. Let me make him bigger. So there's a movement going on. So I think it's pretty cool, but not just like animations. You got elements. So for example, just see the element right here. There's a little line moving. Let me make it bigger. It's actually moving like that. So for example, maybe you're cutting a page and you want to make it animated. So you just flow that there. I think it's pretty cool to have the option. Let's just grab this little guy. And he's moving. Maybe a text bubble. Um, a phone. Let's see what the phone does. So he, the phone just hovers, but it's actually moving. Let's see these guys. Did it move or not? Okay, so they're like nodding the head. But there's just many, many of these that move around that I think it's pretty cool that we have the option. So you got all these right now. Got all those available. You can view modes right here and scenes. And, and like I said before, for example, I've used these three icons right here. Before, I had to download it, then I had to edit it somewhere else and change the colors and then export it. So then I can actually upload it to the site. In this case, I just download it straight away and I upload it. Now, if you guys want to check out my site, this is it, sassum.co. I upload a lot of deals that if you guys want to check it out, I have a whole bunch of top deals and there's the more deals page over here. So some of those links are affiliate. So if you guys want to help me out with some uh, commissions, that's not going to cost you one cent more. I'll, I would thank it a lot. Thank you guys a lot. Well, guys, this is shapes.so. Like I said, the link will be in the description. It's not an affiliate link. If you guys want to grab it, I like I said, I think it's pretty cool. Like you can see right here, a page is way more attractive, attractive when you start seeing moving objects. Now, this is something that I will be implemented with time because I think it's pretty cool. And I think right now, this is what's popular. So if you guys find this interesting, go ahead and grab the deal. All right, guys, my name is George. This is Sass Master, and I'll see you guys later.